Hey guys, I am Forever Game. Welcome back to Let's Play Star Ocean First Departure R Part 18. In the last episode, we talked to the King of Vaughn and we have to go undertake these trials. The true path lies in the shadows, so we're going this way. Okay, save your game and go through the door in the north. In the next room, you will find several doors with individual switches. If you examine the marker in the middle, um, which I'm assuming is this, so... Da, 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 da. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so here. Yeah. There, and then, I think it was this one. Ooh, is this a bad idea? And then, the half one. Is it this one? I think it was this one. And then, I think the other one was like the crescent. Which one was it? This one? Ooh. I think so. It's not giving me a solution. No. What the fuck? I feel like that should have been the solution. Hmm. Okay. Moon room puzzle solution. Do I have to do the opposite? Is it the opposite? Because the shadow, the lights and the shadow or whatever? Switch down rooms one, three. Okay, one. Three. Five and six. What the fuck? Okay, hold on. Can I reset this room? Okay. Switch down rooms one, three, five, and six. Switch up rooms two and seven. Is this down or up? Okay, that's down. That's up, right? Yeah, that's up. That needs to go up. Then three goes down. That's correct. And then four, five goes down six goes down and seven goes up genuinely what was that how was that supposed to that was not that clue or whatever was not that made no sense that clue made no sense Okay, we need to go down the stairs. Okay, who do we have in the party right, the, right now? Mm, tactics. Replace. Um, because our MP is low, I'm gonna replace... Um, you... And you... And then tactics, strategy. You need to heal, okay. And I guess you can attack. Yes. Okay. Yep, because apparently there is a fight. How many years has it been since a human last stroll by? Let's do this. It's that thing that's flying around. 
Where do you think I'm right here? Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. We're surrounded. When did they get there? Okay. Ilya, I need you to make sure he's okay. Okay, we are out of... Okay, we're fine. I think we're fine. We're running out of MP. Just start bopping. We did not need to heal at all. Oh, wow. Okay, just... I guess this is just gonna take a minute. Yay! Chicken shish kebab acquired. That was easy. I'm gonna have to replace my bell. That must have been the master of the dungeon. Come on, let's make a break for the exit. Okay. Well, I'm gonna tactics replace my bell. We let's do Ronix. and then I guess Ilya and Cius. Okay, they have MP, so. Okay, let's make our way. I choose to believe. After the battle, continue left and go to the exit. Yay! Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Escape. Run! Before they cast a spell! <laughs> Whenever I see a mage looking character, run. Get me out. Get me out. I'll fight pretty much everything else. But if I see a mage, that's a no. Oh, God. You will not attack, baby boy. You will not attack my poor Yoshua. It won't happen. Oh. Is everybody gonna die? Oh, you heal. I forgot about that. No, you don't heal. You attack. Oh, see, this is dead. Oh, so that was like a parish song kind of thing, where they just die after a certain period. That was what that was, kind of. Um, tactics. No. Special arts. You. You can revive, right? Spell usage. Can you revive? I don't think you can. Can anybody revive? I don't think she can. Um, spell usage. Can you revive? You cannot revive. Can nobody revive? Huh. Okay, I thought somebody could revive. Single use items. Give me my resurrection. Like, so we have like 14, so I feel fine using them. And apparently this is nearing the end of this part of the dungeon, so we should be fine. Yay! I have to go do the other two? Oh! Okay! Yay! I thought I'd have to go do those other two. Wow, okay. Okay. Thank you, sir. But there is another issue. Specifically, the location of the Demon World entrance and how to open it. Both are closely guarded secrets, not to be shared freely with just anyone. Okay. As a rule, the Demon World entrance cannot be opened from this side. One may only open it if coming from the demon world itself. Okay. There was once someone foolhardy enough to enter the demon world. That being... Returned, albeit near death, his story revealed exactly how appropriate the term demon world really is. He said... Like, I understand. Like, just tell me who it is so we can go. One that he could scarcely believe even existed. Do you still wish to continue? Well, yes. Very well. Your 
Majesty, are you saying there's no way whatsoever to open the... It kind of bothers me that her sprite and her, like, artwork don't look like they're wearing the same clothes. Like, her sprite, like, on screen looks like she's wearing, like, a little orange dress. But here, it's, like, purple and blue. Like, it... It makes no sense to me, to be honest. There are ways to break that rule, of course. After all, it was people on our side that first established a connection between our world and the demon world. How would you like us to do that? Like, yes. give me some help. We'll call them the old oh. Race. I'm sure all of you have heard some tales about them. Their real name is the Mua. That sounds familiar. The Mua? Is that the same Mua as the name of the kingdom? Legend has it they named the land they were created on after themselves. To put it another way, so we need to go to the Mua kingdom. In the area now known as the Muan kingdom. The Muan kingdom, okay. So they called themselves the Mua from the very beginning. Correct. Another legend I don't need this history lesson, to be honest. Like, on the land as fully grown adults, give me my next task. Okay. So they just appeared one day. That Maybe they're aliens. Be true. The old race created a secret treasure and used it to open a gate to another world, the demon world. Okay, so we have to go find the secret treasure. It sounds almost like suicide. Sadly, their motives have not survived in the legends we have today. Okay. The treasure they made is known as the Eye of Truth. So we have to go find it. Said to be a gem, scarlet in color, about the size of your fist. I feel like have we not already seen the Eye of Truth? Was that not what we were going? The Eye of Truth. They say whoever holds Has that not can look into what Have we not already gone and find that? I am familiar with the rumors, yes. I'm sure there are those who pin their hopes on the Eye of Truth. I think that's what we were looking for in that terrible dungeon. The Mua shared information on the whereabouts of the eye with the or maybe it wasn't there. I can't remember. Way, no one could get his hands on the treasure unless he learned the total sum of information that all four kingdoms received. Okay, so we have to go travel around to find them. Okay, cool. You'd need the cooperation of all four different kingdoms? Precisely. And since I have already shared all this with you, I now officially charge you with the top secret duty of finding and procuring the Eye of Truth. Got it. Minister, it is time. Yes, Your Majesty. Is he going to give us something? Like a, an emblem? So we can be the emissaries. Here you are. I assume it's something like a seal, so it'll be like we're official emissaries of Vaughn. Oh, an emblem! Yay! Meet with the kings of each country. Yeah, it's this an emissary. That you possess the truth about the Eye of Truth. Okay, cool. The Vaughn emblem acquired. Okay, cool. So that's what those emblems are. Okay, I thought they were like, they were going to be like actual like things we needed to like grab. From the other Not like, then, and only you then, know, like I things to prove that we're emissaries from a kingdom. I will also grant you this book of oh, thank you. I hope it will aid you in your travels. I wish you the best of luck. Thanks. I guess we'll be back at some point. You obtain four beasts SFT. Okay. Thank you, sir. Okay, cool. We're not leaving yet. We still have what some things to do. What the king had to say, Captain. Aw, them. They're kind of cute. Was Mua or something, all right. The people that formed the old race, you mean? They sound a bit like this world's take on Adam and Eve, don't they? Yeah, I suppose they do. In a world like this one, where mystical power exists as if it's nothing at all, the existence of gods may not be so strange either. 
And if you look at it from an Earth perspective, the way that the Mua simply came into being is not much unlike the way we just suddenly appeared. Right, like you just appeared. At least that's how people here would see it. True enough, but then again, this is a place where a demon world actually exists, where monsters exist, for that matter. Wouldn't take a major leap of faith to believe that gods exist, too. Exactly, like we've seen some crazy well, shit. I've lived on Earth all my life, and I've never run into anything like that. Well, whenever people in the past encountered something they couldn't understand, they usually exactly the which <laughs> if the event was a good thing, it was the blessings of the gods. If it hurt them, it was the cruel workings of demons and devils. Exactly. That's right. That's how concepts such as okay, like it feels like they're talking at like talk like they're talking at me, not to each other. Agreed. Earth was no exception. Like, Europeans used to tell tales of a monster that this is not some seminar, like, I understand, but, like, this does not feel like a conversation. Well, it feels like they're talking to me and not each other, like. What? Lightning. Oh, lovely. There's still a staggering amount we don't know about the universe we live in. What did they call it? Symbology? That healing power Millie has. Does Ronix not have it too? To he honest. he uses some light powers. And yet I'm sure there's some way to explain it scientifically. You Who's really to don't say? Believe the king, do you, Elia? Can you blame me? Not really, no. If I just accept all these supernatural beings and phenomena at face value, well, I'd feel like I'm betraying myself a little. Well, Ilya, what is the other explanation that you have? Sure. We'd never advance as a civilization if we did that. Besides... Besides what? If you keep telling yourself that everything is a simple matter of fate, you start feeling like life itself is so trite, somehow. Oh, do you? Are you talking about... Wife! Your wife, Captain? What do you mean, wife? Yeah. Wife? Hold on, is Ilya a home wrecker? It was a disease. Oh, she's no dead. Okay, thank God. I know it was a terrible loss for you. She's dead. There's okay, cool. Modern medical science. I mean, that's terrible for him, but like, and her, but obviously, but like, I'd rather that than Ilya be a home wrecker. Cause I thought Ilya and the captain were, were like a thing. But you know. She seemed jealous when he was with Mavell. The symbology they have here was all they needed to cure. I choose to believe this was a while ago. I'm sure I'd be kicking myself over it for the rest of my life. Oh, well, too bad. Please don't do this to yourself, Captain. Remember the virus that Lazonia unleashed upon Planet Rogue? Millie herself told us that symbology couldn't do a exactly. thing to keep it from spreading. You can't torture yourself over it your whole life, Captain. Exactly, you need to move on again, with Ilya. Sure telling you that won't help much, will it? This journey's been an interesting one. If we keep it up, I'm sure I'll find the answer soon enough. But now we should hit the sack. All right. Good night, Captain. I like that the thing that stopped me in my tracks about that conversation the most was him having a, potentially a wife <laughs> i was like oh no not Ilya. but thank god Ilya is not a home wrecker why did he apologize to her because he knows he he knows that she likes him and he brought up his what his dead wife Morning. Sleep well. shapely hostess like jesus where's the decorum yes fairy you remember that was so un shapely know? hostess i remember we need to go to the kingdoms I said I know. Right? Like, <laughs> right. Don't forget to show them the emblem. Cool. Got it. Let's roll out. We're not ready to leave yet. We need to go back to the castle. Apparently, there's things we can grab. Seven stars in. Okay. Th where is the exit? Thank you. So we need to go back to the castle. Excuse me. 
We need to go explore the castle. Hello. Whatever talents you have, determine what things you'll be good at doing. As someone who lives and dies by the sword, I'm really jealous of Highlanders. It must be nice to be born with a natural talent for sword fighting. Hello. Apparently, there was once a magic mirror that could replicate exactly any object that was reflected in it. Okay. It's locking off, but don't tell anybody. So I can't go down there? I cannot go down there. Okay. Let's go up, then. Second floor to the balcony. Though, I've been studying geology for a very long time now, I know, but there's a high possibility a legendary precious stone exists in the abandoned mine in Mount Matorx. The stone's called Mithril. Maybe if I had a pickaxe, I could dig up somewhere in the mine. Well, I couldn't even go to the mine, so... I'm studying the different races on this planet. Recently, I discovered that a race of cat-like people called the Lesser Felpool still exists. Mm, girls with cat ooh. We're running out of ideas. Perhaps we need to create a powerful weapon of our own. How will we enter the demon world? Nobody said anything cheerful to say these days. I'm getting sick of it. Real. Oh, hello. Live the sage. We're currently unable to open the gateway to the demon world at will. The monsters seem to be able to open and close it whenever they please. We get the magic clay. According to a monster we captured recently, Asmodeus, lord of the demon world, is trying to create a weapon of horrifying power. When I first heard that something had crashed into Mua, I honestly feared the worst. That being said, the crash still puzzles me. It's a spaceship. Is there anything? No. Okay, so I guess we're going to keep going up. Oh, what does this dude have to say? Rami, oh Rami, wherefore art thou? Oh, Julie, I'm coming, my love. Rami, what the hell do you think you're doing away from your post? Get back here at once. I'm sorry, so sorry. Aw, that was funny. No, don't take him away from me, Rami. Wait for me, Julie. I'll find you wherever you are. Enough. They said you have a shift to do. That is funny. It's weird how Rami and I hooked up. We hit it off just because our names were similar to those of the hero and heroine of this one story. And we just started dating from there. Well, you know, congratulations to you two. Ooh. If somebody gave you a hundred presents, would you be able to love that person a hundred times over? It doesn't work like that, does it? It's just about how much time you spend with that person and how much you understand each other, isn't it? <sighs> if only I'd realized that sooner. Heartbroken and nor. Okay. Okay, hold on. Actually, I want to go back up. There. What are they talking about? Yes, sir. I've had enough of you clowning around. Do I make myself clear? He is sick of those two in their theatrics. Okay, so this side we've gone through. What about this side? Hello. Picture imbued with the artist spirit becomes magical in nature. As for me, if I want a magical picture, I just draw it myself. It's certainly much cheaper than buying one. Hello. I've decided to... I'm trying to decide whether I should customize this sword. It's a tough decision to make considering I'll end up with a useless piece of junk if I fail. We get the Emerald Ring. We'll have to give that to somebody. Okay, and the Labyrinth. If you go downstairs, you can go back to the Labyrinth train. You can go up to get the clay. Okay, you're done for now. You can exit the town. Okay, so if I want to go train, I'll go to the Labyrinth. Anything else? I want to see what the queen has to say. I pray that there's light at the end of your journey. Make sure you return to me once you have met all the other kings. Keep discussions in the eye of truth a secret. Okay, cool. Okay, yay. So that was what we had to do in this town. Cool, cool, cool. We bought, we bought food, right? I think we bought food. Okay, so where are we going next? Exit the town and make your way back to Ekdart. Okay. Which one is Ekdart? Ekdart! Oh god, it's all the way over there. It's difficult to find a good answer to what you're thinking on your own, isn't it? What? Okay. Whatever. I didn't want to go back here, but cool.
Hello. Perhaps we should be focusing on meeting the kings in order to obtain the Eye of Truth. Thank you, that's where I was going. As I guess I accidentally pressed a button. Okay, but we need to make our way back to Ektar. Oh, okay, this team is fine. Oh god. That's a witch. Escape. Sius, I swear to god. Why is Sius... Sius is the only one that I feel like this ever happens to. I feel like Sius and Ilya. Everybody else kind of does what I fucking tell them to do. Special arts. You. Spell usage. Heal Sius. Oh god. Um. Cure light. There. Okay. Like, Sius, I'm begging you to do what I fucking tell you to do. We need to make our way back to Ektar. I think, apparently, we're going back to Astral. I guess that's where we need to go. To the King of Astral. We could fight, sure. We need the EXP. Thank you. Sometimes he's good. People allege that he's the worst party member of the game. I remember I watched, like, a thing. They were like, Mavel's the best, Ronix is the worst. Okay, so C's gained a level, so I'm going to actually switch him out for Ilya. Because I think Ilya... We were trying to get Ilya somewhere. Okay, yay. And then we'll keep Bronix till he's level 33, and then replace him with Mavel. Oh, God. Escape. Yay. See, if that was Sius, he'd have ran into battle, probably against that witch. Or the mage, whatever it's called. But yay, we need to make our way. God, I wish we could fast travel in this game. You kind of can with the ships, but like, other than that, you don't really get anything. Oh, the bot. Okay. He's sometimes very good. But yeah, our next destination is the Astral Kingdom. We need to make our way back to Ektar, and then sail to Trop, and then from Trop, walk to Tatroy, and then go back to Tatroy. We can take a ship to Astral City. Like, what a mess. Oh, this will be easy. This will be easy. I'm not even going to waste my MP on them. I thought he had, like, a bow and arrow. Like, why is he doing this? Yay! When is Ilya gonna get a level? I think I was trying to get her to level up something. But who's to say? Okay, we're almost there, though. Almost. We're almost there. And I feel like we need to fight most, if not all, of these battles. Oh my god. Oh my god, help him. Whenever they attack Yoshua, I get a little scared. Because if they kill Yoshua, I can't heal. I mean, I can, but we have to go really out of our way. Yay, we got a 16-ounce steak, too. Okay, we are back around the curve. So we just need to make our way back to the coast. Oh god, not the furries. Yay! Some of his attacks are really cool. I like how he does everybody attacks. Like, the whole screen is a miss when he attacks. It's the whole thing. It's so pleasant. He just doesn't attack that often. Ronix, he will really only attack once or twice a battle. It's kind of sad. Um, skills. Learn skills. What was I working for with Ilya? Was it determination? I think it was determination, so actually we need to keep her in the party for right now. You don't have anything, you don't have anything. Uh, see this is so close. That's sick. Mm. 
No, I feel like Ronix needs to be because he's one of the lowest level party members we have right now. He needs to stay in the party. He needs to stay in the party. Dies. This ought to be simple. Do we have to worry about this? And debatably, like, I could take Roddick off the front of the party and, like, just bench him for a second. But, like, I like playing as Roddick. He's simple. I feel like I do the least amount of damage with Roddick. Like, overall. Like, to the party. Not, like, damage, like, he doesn't do damage. But, like, I do personally the least amount of damage possible. Oh, God. Escape. Don't hit the bird. <laughs> the bird. Don't hit the bird. We may... Where is this? Um, give me a happy camper. Alcohol. Hello. Hey, Roddick. Promise me you'll never leave me again, okay? I was so lonely without you. Oh, I love Roddick and Millie. I never knew how wide the world was until I joined you on the journey. When I was a child, the world... I feel like I've talked to everybody in this town. And the Mavels at, like, that little bar. Like, right outside the bar in that little alleyway. Like, we've talked to them here. We get to meet all the kings around the world, right? I can't wait to see their castles. Well, we'll make their we'll make our way. I think I'm gonna heal in Ekdart. I think that's where I'll heal. Where were we just now? We were in Ionis. We need to make our way to Ekdart. I think once we get to Ekdart, we'll rest. That's what we'll rest. Hello. How they just like start gang banging him. I know that that's not the most appropriate word to use, but, like, I don't know how else to describe it. Like, they all just, like, gang up on him. And they just, like, bop you around. Like, it's sad. Right. Jesus, I may need to switch out Ilya because she's running out of MP. Actually, yeah, I'll switch out Ilya. She's running out of MP. Replace. Ilya. See, yes. Then I think what's Ronix? He gains a level, I'll replace him with Mavel. Or maybe I'll put back in Ilya. I don't know. Because I think Mavel's already pretty good. Like, I feel like everybody else just kind of sucks worse than her. See, they're doing it again. Where they bought him back and forth. Not baby boy. You will not be touching Bard. I'm like, oh wow. Why are the furries getting me? Probably because I talk bad about them. Oh my god, help him. See, this is supposed to be our tank, but like he does such a bad job at it. Like I feel like he's so frail for a tank. Like he's really bad for our tank. Like he's the closest thing we have. Yoshua learned Thundercloud. Basically, if I played them offensively, like, I would use it, but I feel like I never need to play, I never play them offensively. Yoshua and Millie? Um, what a cute little town. Let me find it. Just have a walk around. Oh, yeah, I guess. Um, where is the inn in this town? I cannot remember. Oh, here it is. But I've, I've, like, fractured the party so i mean i guess i could just leave but i want to talk to them mavel oh a scene mavel are you sure you want to go through with this revenge of yours yes that that's all i have left i love mavel like she's spoken like three sentences but i really like her it just looks like you're throwing in the towel to me Maybe I am, but such is the path that I've chosen. I love it. Like, I love this arc. Now what will happen after you've gotten your revenge? Do you know? I... I'm too busy dealing with the present to think about that. Sorry to make you worry about me. 
No, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to put you on the spot like that. Hmm. I think he likes her. Living for nothing but revenge, that's no way to live. I appreciate you worrying about me, but... Mavel. Oh, he didn't say that. <laughs> he didn't say it like that. I understand well enough, but I, I still... You don't have to hold it all in yourself. We're here for you. Thank you. Oh, I love Mavelle and her purple color scheme. It's so pretty in this game. We're lucky. We're still able to do something about this problem. Those poor people who turned into stone didn't even know what hit them. Uh, don't remind me of poor Dorn. <laughs> I was kind of waiting when they were having this moment for it to pan somewhere to Ilya and for her to be like, oh God, like, and for her to be jealous. I was about to be like, oh, if this is, if this game was fun, they'd pan to Ilya somewhere watching, like being like a hater. And they did. What on earth were they talking about? They had quite a scene going on, whatever it was. She is jealous. Okay, where is... Not where I'm looking for. I don't think we need to go there. Where's the bar? I need to talk to Seas and Yoshua. Okay, there's the bar. No, that's the food shop. Where the fuck is the bar? Have we gone this way? No, Yoshua. Yeah, Yoshua's on the bridge. I apologize. My parents were killed not far from here, so I can't help but be reminded of it. Uh, this is sad. Not baby boy. Is this the bar? This is the bar. Vaughn has his fair share of history with the sword too. I bet they've got some killer swordsmen over there. Well, we're not going to Vaughn. But I guess you only have one, like, little setting for a town. I was shocked. I'm shocked that we got that little scene with Ronix and Mavelle. We should all meet the kings to get a hold of the Eye of Truth. I understand. Thank you for... I don't need you to tell me that every time we go into a city. But I do need us to rest, and then we'll make our way. To the inn. Rest at the inn. And then we're going to leave the city and save. I'm going to leave the city and save. Because I feel like we've been going for, like, a good second. Yay, okay. So, in the next episode, I think we will... They're gonna do this again. Oh, they didn't, thank God. In the next episode, we will return to the Astral Continent and, you know, make our way. So, that's gonna be all for now, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!